There's a term for this, by the way. Uh, there's a term for this. It's called role reversal, right? Yeah, if you're from my generation, it's called Freaky Friday. <laughs> And it is indeed quite weird, okay? Like, like, like you know what, I, I, I didn't see it coming. There, it, there were signs and I should have known. Like, I, I took my mom to the dentist. She hates the dentist. She's complaining, she's dragging her feet. She doesn't want to get in the chair. And I heard myself say, if you behave yourself. <laughs> I'll take you to the liquor store. Now, here's the thing, I was already going for me, but she didn't need to know that. <laughs> but this is so weird for me, right? Because when I, when I was growing up, my mom was the disciplinarian in the house, okay? My mom's Jamaican, they, they beat children professionally. <laughs> <laughs> but what was cool about my mom is that she would never spank me at the moment I did something wrong. She would wait. <laughs> She called it waiting until she had calmed down. <laughs> Which sounds really good in theory. In practice, it meant I never knew when it was coming. <laughs> when I would least suspect it, my mother would swoop down out of nowhere and be like, so, you want to put crayons in the washing machine? <laughs> I'm like, Ma, that was 30 years ago. <laughs> I, I think there's a statute of limitations. <laughs> but you know, you do know that as you, as you get older, that mother-daughter relationship gets complicated, right? <laughs> Yeah, and I, I say that, I say that um, because whenever I go to book club, me and my girlfriends always end up talking about our moms. Yeah, that, that's how book club turned into wine club. <laughs> now we just read the labels on wine bottles. <laughs> Alcohol content, 12%. Ladies, I think we have a bestseller. <laughs> Now, I, I, I will tell you guys, I'll tell you guys, I, I love my mom, but I'm a daddy's girl. Yeah. yeah. That's, that's why my favorite movie is Taken. Look, every girl wants to believe that if she gets kidnapped, her dad is gonna come for her, right? And I believe that, I believe if I got kidnapped, my dad would come for me but my dad is 84. <laughs> it, it's gonna take a while. <laughs> He's gonna have to look for his glasses, find his car keys. He's gonna be clipping coupons, trying to get a deal for me. <laughs> Cause my dad's a funny dude, man. I, uh, I took him to the doctor and uh, we walk in and I'm like, daddy, we, we have been in every department here except OBGYN. And he goes, I know, take me there. Maybe I'll get lucky. <laughs> we, um, I took him to Burger King, you know, cause he had coupons. Um, he got his food, but his change was short by a penny. Yeah, yeah, you, uh, you can't shortchange old people. Cause my dad is from that generation that can do math. <laughs> In his head. <laughs> That's magic to me. <laughs> Cause I'll be honest, I'm, I'm not good at math, right? But a lot of people aren't, right? Like I was, uh, I was shopping the other day and um, I got to the register and my bill came to $8 and 50 cents. I gave the cashier $10, she rang it in. I then found and gave her 50 cents and she froze. <laughs> 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 
She stood so still for so long, I thought we were playing freeze tag and nobody told me. <laughs> Finally, she said, I don't know how much to give you back. I said, $10. <laughs> Cause I'm not good at math. <laughs> Local man robs Wendy's with alligator. We're the alligator boys now. And the lady, they sit in the bank, she be going, Mom, Mom, 